Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. Dear brothers and sisters, here's the third floor that we have made. This is a kitchen area and it's just been cleaned, uh, getting ready for the school. But as you can see, uh, this is a whole floor like this. And it goes back like that. And then as you can see out there, there's a walk out from there uh, to the deck. And there's a room there that has to be, that's going to be our kitchen, our professional kitchen. So we're going to have this as a cafeteria style because our kids are not actually fitting into the lunchroom. We have to take now two or three lunches, with different, uh, different grades and it's becoming very arduous for us. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. Dear brothers and sisters, here we are. Um, as you can see, I showed you the inside. And why I'm showing you the outside here is because we're going to be going up like this. And you see from here, it's going to go across. So the third floor and the fourth floor is going to come across like that. And then it's going to go all the way back. Not to the first railing, but to the second railing. So uh, as you can see the deck in front of you, this is going to be put on top of the fourth floor. So the people on the fifth floor can actually go out. So it, this is going to be raised. But this area is going to be, as uh, let me come in front of you, it's going to be a, a, a place where we can have our gatherings. In Ramadan, we can't, there's not enough space. People, are, when it's raining, we don't know where to put them. Because the sisters are downstairs, we shove the brothers upstairs in classrooms. So we have literally outgrown the place, especially for the kids also. The school, 150 kids at a minimum. We are, have to be able to have space. Now we're doing lunch, two lunches, three lunches at a time. It's becoming very worrisome for us in, in order to have proper lunch time because we cannot just, lunch time cannot be at 10 o'clock in the morning or two, two o'clock in the afternoon. So we need to be able to have a set thing for, for our community and for our school. So school is a big sadaqa jariya for you, inshallah. We're saving our kids. What better thing that you want other than the school, really? That they get good manners, that they understand who they are, that they get dignity, that they get integrity, and that they know their identity. So, so many things that you can actually help with, and the ajr is for you. The second plea is for the, for the cameras outside there and for the cameras inside. We have to be able to take our our precaution first. There's a lot of things happening. We have an intercom system. Our uh, our uh, uh, grant, uh, we had asked for a grant from the government. They had these grant programs for security cameras. And we have been trying four months, five months, and then they rejected. And we wanted to find out why they rejected. Very little reasons were given. We're still pursuing that, but I think it, what they don't want to give, they don't want to give. So we found a uh, a person that can actually do it for 18,800 plus tax and he's given us a lot an intercom system that's worth $8,000 and it's he's given it to us for 2,500 and plus the the, the LED uh, watch that you can see who's coming in through the door so that the principal will be able to let them in we need all of these things in place especially in these times brothers and sisters so help us inshallah uh, so 22,000 if everyone gives $200, we should be able to finish this in no time, inshallah. There's go going to, you know, thousands of people. So if you watch this, inshallah, if you read even the emails, give something towards the deen and become a pledge member or pay something towards the security system so that we can at least do something for our community. The vision is there. The vision has always been there. So inshallah, we're starting late and uh, we're starting, but late better than never, inshallah. Take care. Assalamu alaikum wa